is Klaus. Welcome to episode five in Kolobanov's Metal Week. And today we get to watch Terfet Pitakos in his T20 get a result like this. Look at this, Bulls Metal, Kolobanov's Defender, High Caliber, Tank, Sniper, and Top Gun. Well, now you know what he's done. Let's see how he's done it. And there's been five of these videos. I'll leave the links at the end of this one. And there's a button in the top right-hand corner where you can vote. A little I. Move your mouse to the top right-hand corner. And it has all five choices. After you watch this game, you vote on which one you think was the most epic. We're going to watch Derfet Pitakos in the T20 today. Yesterday, we had Salvager in his in his E25, and then Doom Slinger in his Loosh, Lead Ram 666 in his AMX ELC Bliss, and Chris in his KV-1S. If you haven't seen those videos, watch them. I'm gonna tally up the votes here and do something special to uh, celebrate. I haven't decided what yet, but decide something. Now, Derfet Pitakos is obviously not English, sounds like Spanish to me, and I think that means in Spanish that uh, I feel sorry for you. Uh, it either means that, or it means I like to make large tacos. Not really sure. I'm not up on my Spanish, but I think it's uh, pretty sure it means one of those things. And uh, <laughs> he's moving up on the hill here. And he's going to win this game. You know he's going to win. Let's see how he does it. It's Kolobanov's medal week. So you know it's a Kolobanov win. Now, usually with Kolobanov's medal, well, not usually. It's necessary that your whole team dies so that it's just you versus five, at least five enemies at the end, uh, and you win. So a lot of the people that win Kolobanov's medal, and it's Kolobanov's, it's not Kolobanov's, it's Kolobanov's, because that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it! There, he's got his first kill. A lot of the time, the people that win Kolobanov's medal, they kind of sit back and uh, stay safe the whole game, and their team dies, and then they end up winning the game at the end. And that is a good strategy. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, that means they're preserving their HP, and they're playing uh, conservatively, and they don't want to die right away to keep their gun in the game. But Derfet Petakos, the big taco maker, now let's think of something else. What does Derfet Pitakos mean? I'm not sure. If I could figure this out before the replay, I could like not insult this guy. Do not want to insult you. Epic uh, game you've sent, and you're a great subscriber, and you're a badass boss. Look at this. He moves right up. He's not going to hide at the back like a pussy. He's moved right up here on the hill. And look at that. There are two artillery on the enemy team. So this is very risky, and he's been shot, and he's hoping that the rest of the pussies on his team will also Derfet Pitakos and move up and Derfet Pitakos with them. Because he's here by himself. He's pushed up to light these guys. He's got three or four pussies behind them that are not doing anything. And he's in the line of fire. There's guys down there by the base on the tracks that could shoot him. There's artillery that could shoot him. Everybody on the fucking enemy team can shoot him. They can shoot him from the middle. They can shoot him from anywhere here. So he is not playing this like a pussy. He's playing like a boss. And look at those four guys behind him. They have not moved up yet. He's moving up here. Oh, he's bounced a shot. He's spotted. Where's those artillery hits? Are they, they're, There it is. There it is. The artillery's focusing on him. He's moving around. He's not sitting still. He's moving back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. That's what it means. Derfet de Patakos, back and forth, back and forth. Derfet de Patakos, right? He's doing it. He's doing it like a boss. And he's calling help. There's one, his platoon mate has moved up, and there's three other guys. There's like fucking five of them. He's pinging the map. Oh, the artillery's focusing on the tiger, fortunately. But if the other pussies would move up, maybe they could like make a solid push here and take these guys out. But no, no, no. Oh, finally, finally they've moved up. But he's lost a lot of HP. Well, you know, he's doing pretty good. He's, do he's derfeted spectacles. Oh, look at this, the artillery thing. Maybe that's why he was asking those guys to move up, so that the artillery would concentrate on them. But I think it's just because he's gone stealth now, and the heavy tanks are spotted, so he is not spotted. If he pokes this, if he pokes up there to shoot this guy, he will be spotted. 
and oh, that, oh, that artillery. Now they've got to do something or get out of there because the artillery is just going to reload and reload and reload and keep shooting and keep shooting. And that artillery is going to dead fit petacos out of their asses. And speaking of asses, he's got a shot on. Oh, no, he's not shooting the ass. He's shooting the side of that guy. He had an ass shot, but he's going for the side shot. Is he going to get this shot here? He is going to take that guy out. Okay, now he's dead fetting petacos like a boss. And it's still a, a, a pretty close game. He's taking some long range shots there. Oh, and he's got that guy. He dis you can disappear, but you cannot hide. And now he's going to shoot the ARL. The ARL is in cover. And oh, there's the guys on the hill here. You know, you go on the hill, you either make a solid push or you just don't go because especially well if there's artillery right so they they went up on the hill there and they kind of just drove to the edge and stopped and well they're dead because there's artillery in the game <laughs> all right let's see what he does now he's backing up gracefully he's trying to get some shots on this arl take a shot on him yes he's got him and he's got to get out of the line of fire now his teammates are dying it's 8 10 but it's still pretty close Oh, and here's a guy on a hill, and a guy on the bottom of the hill. So there's one on top and one at the bottom. The ARL is in the water. His J Panzer whatever has decided to fall off the cliff to fight the guy in the water because that's a good strategy, right? The, the guy's in the water, he can't do anything. Don't ignore him, just go down there and die together in the water. Frolic in the water together and, and you know, whatever. That's a good strategy. Okay, so let's see what he does here. He's going to have a shot at this guy in a second, but there's a guy on the hill, and his team is dying. There's three of them left. He's going to try and poke the hill here, but these guys got the bushes now. So if he pokes up, he's going to get spotted. There's nothing he can do. He's got to kill the ARL who's going to light him. The ARL's going to light him, and he's going to get his ass already. So he's going to dead fet petacos his ass on the move, falling down in the water. And he got him, and now he is stuck. He cannot get out this way, so he's kind of screwed. And there's the artillery shot, and it ain't looking good. There's six enemies left, and how many teammates? He's got the artillery and a dick. Urs Max, his teammate. The dick, Urs Max, is on the one line, and oh, 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 there's a guy up here. He is spotted. There's an AMX behind him. Oh, what does he do? He's got to get in the low ground so the AMX can't shoot him up the ass. He's got to try and shoot this guy. He does not have the gun elevation. This is very awkward. It does not... Uh, uh, the artillery is dead. It's just him and the dick. Urs Max. The dick. Urs Max is fighting an OI. He takes out this guy. There's five enemies left. And it's just him and the dick. Urs Max. And here's the ELC. Let's keep your eye on the dick. Urs Max is dead. So it's him versus five. Okay. And he's already got five kills. He's got to get 10 kills. And there's one. He's got to get four more kills to win this game, basically. Unless, you know, the enemy poofs let him cap. But that ain't going to happen. He's got to win now. He's got to kill everybody. And that'll put him on 10. Well, you saw it already. 10 kills. And he wins the game. And he is, uh, he's, he's still got some health. But where does he go? What does he do? Perfect, the Patacos. Que pasa? Ma que pasa? Oh! Oh, wait a minute. That's more Italian than, uh, than Spanish. Nosotros estiamo muy barachos. Andere, andere, vit. Arriva. Or whatever. What the fuck? My, I, my Spanish sucks. What, what can I tell you? But Perfect, the Patacos is going to make it a move here, huh? He's going to get behind these guys. Oh, there's one. There's one. And it's... Oh, what the... It's an artillery going out for a drive. What the hell was that? I thought, you know, maybe the team would spot and the artillery would shoot, but, well, I'm always going off on the artillery, right? The SPG, P stands for propelled, but none of them ever fucking propel themselves anywhere. That guy was actually propelling himself, but Jesus Christ. I mean, he knew that the guy was on the hill the whole game. Why the fuck would you propel yourself on that side of the tracks? Why wouldn't you propel yourself somewhere safe? Who the hell knows? Because, I mean, I don't know. If you play artillery, 
you would understand. No, 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 you wouldn't understand. It's uh, whatever, artillery. Yeah. Okay, now this guy has no view range, and he's a big, huge heavy tank, so he's disappeared. And there's two of them in the cap, and he's running out of time. And I was ranting there, but he got two shots on the O knee, or whatever the hell it was, the O I. And now let's count it here 73, 75, 77. He's getting capped out. The enemies are pussies, they're capping, they don't want to just go kill him, but you know, 89, 91, 93, 95, 97, and he's got the reset at 97. He shot the OI, they did not hit him back because they're stupid, and oh, he's got him again, and they did not shoot him back because they're stupid, and he's gonna do one more shot, but you know, he's gonna get the, the and they're not shooting him back because they're stupid, but it's 87, the other guy was hiding behind the one was stupid and one was hiding. 91, I'll count out the percentage here. 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, and he's got it. He's got it reset at 97. And he took one hit from the two morons that were in the cap. One that would not shoot and one that just hit like a pussy. Holy shit, he did fat petacos out of their ass, I'll tell you that much. And this one's looking exciting. Where the hell is the last guy? And, the, oh, and of course, the last guy is an artillery, but it is an M44, and the M44 can one-shot him. He could die if he gets hit, so he cannot be stupid about this. He's got nine kills. Come on, buddy, you can do it, and he's going to cross the tracks. No, he's not going to cross the track. He's going to head that way. He's gone stealth now, and he's approaching through the bushes because he does not want to get spotted, which which is smart. Here he goes. He doesn't even look nervous. Look at this. He knows what he's doing. Oh, there he is. He spotted the artillery, who's an idiot sitting in the open. He's not even in a bush. And Dad Fat the Patakos gets a hit. The artillery misses him. And he's going to take the last shot and win the game. Yes, he does it. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Over, almost 4,000 damage, 10 kills. Shot some APCR, so it did not make a huge profit. But there you have it. Five episodes. Vote. The button is on the top right-hand corner, that little white eye. Click it. And there's five choices that you can pick. Let's pick who had the most epic Kolobanov's medal victory. And the other four games, if you haven't seen them, the links are on the screen. All five of you guys, way to go. That was epic. It was an epic week. And I tell you, you know, it's going to be tough to pick. But you guys get to vote. I'll tally up the votes and I'll do a follow-up video where I, I will announce the winner. Yeah, not that he wins anything. But we'll do something, eh? uh, something exciting uh, when I do the, uh, the announcement. Make sure you vote. Watch all five videos and vote. Kolobanov's Metal Week only on Klaus's channel.